But it's not just men, because I have to say, well, ladies, y'all are rude. I can't tell you how many women that I have had walk up to me, total strangers, poke me in the chest and say, are those real? I'm like, yes. And every one of them says, we don't have real ones in L.A. I said, well, it's because you don't eat nothing. Feed yourself, people. Get a moon pie, really. But you know what, even if you have breasts, it's, it's hard dating in L.A. Even, you know, men or women, by golly. But I have a suggestion, because a really great place to meet somebody is the grocery store. Yep, it is. But I have a tip for you men that you better remember until the day you die. Only hit on the girls that are all dolled up. Because if you hit on a girl in there in a pair of Hello Kitty pajamas holding a <laughs> quart of ice cream, She's having a bad day. <laughs> you don't want to go there, trust me. I've had a lot of those bad days, which is probably why I named my butt cheeks Ben and Jerry. <laughs> Men that'll never leave me. Yeah. But no, I mean, it is. It's, it's very hard dating here in, in L.A., and, and especially because people are weird and they have weird jobs. Like, I have this friend of mine, I'm not making this up, she works in an S&M parlor. Mm -hmm. Men pay her big bucks just to spank them. You don't pay Southern women to do things like that. I mean, honey, I'd whoop a man's butt for a bag of pork rinds and a Pepsi. <laughs> and the next one of you men, next one of you men, y'all are rude, I'll do it for free. Bless your heart. Nighty night, y'all.